Well, here we are again at one of my favorite places on earth, the boardwalk in area four at Del Norwegian's Pass State Park in North Naples, Florida on a beautiful Sunday afternoon. Starting to heat up here. 84 degrees already, 84 degrees. Expecting today's high to get up around, oh, 93. Probably gonna get some thunderstorms this afternoon. Gotta keep that humidity up. We don't want that humidity dropping down too low. <laughs> oh, that'd be nice if the humidity dropped. But that's part of life in Florida, high humidity. Gorgeous now, gorgeous. Thanks for joining in. We had a wonderful beach walk earlier this morning down on Vanderbilt Beach. Now we'll have another one at Wiggins Pass. Ooh, Delnor Wiggins Pass State Park. One of many, many beautiful Florida state parks. Beautiful view there, isn't that gorgeous? It isn't that lovely. <laughs> the palm fronds, the blue sky, the blue water right now, the water picking up the blue from the sky. Nice and calm out there. Little breeze, the sea oats blowing in the breeze. We'll see what old Mother Nature has in store for us this Tuesday. Fortunately, it looks like we've dodged a bullet. And the folks in maybe the northern Texas coast, Louisiana, looks like they might be in for a rough ride here early this week. Keep those people in your thoughts and prayers. I don't know if we got any friends there in the projected paths of these two storms. But we'll keep your safety in our prayers, your safety and well-being. I love the view from up here. It just never, ever gets old. The view from up here on the boardwalk.
That's always one of my favorites. Looking through the sea oats. Roy sitting out there on the beach. That little dot out there in the center of the screen, there's our buddy Roy. Got him settled in. Thank you for the stars already this morning. I appreciate that. As you know, your financial support is what keeps Southwest Florida television going now more than ever. Now it is an official business, not just a little page on Facebook. It is an official business. Every once in a while, early morning along the dunes here, you catch a gopher tortoise out for a morning stroll. Mary, prayers for Mary's mom. Keep our friend Mary's mom in your prayers. Anybody else needing prayers, please. If you need prayers for you, a family member, a friend, even one of your pets, please don't hesitate in putting your prayer needs in the comments here. Let everyone know. That's what these live feeds are all about. That's what this page is all about. It's about bringing people together, caring for each other, supporting each other. Strength in numbers. When it comes to prayers, the more people you have praying for you, the better. We all love the beach, the beautiful beach. That's what brings us together that's what initially brought you here is the beach but then once you figured out what was going on you started reading the comments people are making you realize that there's way more to it than the beach this is a beach family we are a family if you're just tuning in welcome to our family don't be shy introduce yourself let everyone know where you're watching from. Stick around, hang out with us. This is much more relaxing than looking at all the bad stuff on social media right now. This is our morning happy place.
more of those beautiful sea oats. That's what I think of when I think of the beach, the beautiful blue sky, the sea oats and the sand, the white sand, that view right there. That is what I think of when I think of the beach here in Southwest Florida. I love these little access pathways to the beach. These little pathways to paradise. Creating little windows to paradise. Good morning. Good morning. Back in here. How are you doing? I'm doing fine, are you? Wonderful. One of our little picnic areas. They've thinned out the picnic tables. But you can find these picnic tables just tucked in behind the beach. Yeah, it's a good idea to bring some bug spray when you come out here. Another little pathway out to the beach. Another little window to paradise. I just love the way the trees frame up the views. Just gorgeous. Hi, Cindy. We want to keep Cindy in our prayers. Cindy's going in for some surgery here. Right, Cindy? I didn't miss it, all right? Got so many things on my mind here. It's This week is your surgery, isn't it? Peace, love, and happiness. I love it. Thank you, Mike. Peace, sending peace, love, and happiness. And bacon. Where's the bacon? Mike, you forgot the bacon. Good morning, Margaret. I want to go back to that other pathway and walk out onto the beach. That's one of my favorites, the boardwalk and this other pathway here in Area 4 when the sea oats are still in bloom.
those of you not familiar with the park here, I am in parking lot four, just about the middle of parking lot four. I want to show you how close the beach is to the parking lot. And this particular spot has a great, great boardwalk from the parking lot to the beach. And also, just right over here on the left, right over here on the left is the concession stand. It's not open yet, but right here in the middle of parking lot four is where you'll find the concession stand. So remember that, especially if you got kids that are in need of snacks and treats. <laughs> Parking lot four, it's got the area four beach is the widest, close to the concession stand. To the south end of area four is, there's a nice bathhouse with outdoor showers. And this beautiful, relatively still new boardwalk here that the Rangers built. Our talented, friendly rangers, James and Steve and Mark and Terrence and Sarah and, oh, oh, Kevin, our new ranger, Kevin. One more, Forget, forgetting somebody. Oh, Dave, our new ranger, Dave. This is what I love though, just that anticipation of getting out onto the beach, walking out these little sandy pathways, seeing the sea oats blowing in the breeze. Then you come out to the end and voila. A beautiful 180 degree view of our gorgeous beach at Del Norwegans. A mile, give or take a couple feet here, depending where the tide's at, but about a mile of beach, mile of shoreline. Let's put it that way, a mile of shoreline. And it could not be any easier to get to this park. Just get off exit I-75 at exit 111. Exit 111 in North Naples, which is Immokalee Road. Immokalee Road, exit 111 and go west. And you'll wind up at the park. You'll go over a little bridge, come to a little three-way stop four-way stop. It's kind of a parking lot on one side, but a four-way stop. And just beyond that is the entrance to the park. Come out and enjoy these beautiful sights and sounds and people. As you can see, it's pretty quiet. Keep going right out into the water.
little bit of, I think it's some red drift algae out here. You can smell it on the beach. Little fishies, little fishies swimming around. All the little bait fish out here. <laughs> Some of them are getting pretty big. Some of them are getting pretty big now. Back at the beach. I can feel the little fish down by my feet. into the sun there. Whew. Bright, bright, bright. Our dancing water diamonds down there. Our dancing water diamonds. I like that. Our friend Dorothy uses that term the dancing water diamonds. I'll look down to the south. where we were earlier down where those condos are in the center of the screen there that's Vanderbilt Beach that's where we did our first live feed we had our first beach walk this morning in Vanderbilt beautiful colors we saw some gorgeous colors this morning you might want to check the replay out of that video Saw so one of our great blue heron friends, some of our ibises, we followed some of our ibises along the beach. No dolphins or manatees. breezy here. A little breezy. Hard to see the fish with the wind putting the ripples in the water. I see Roy's got some company up there. Somebody chatting with him. by me. Did you see that? Low level. It was a low level attack. I don't know where Nana is. I haven't seen Nana out here picking up the trash. So 
something just snuck up behind me and bumped into my heel. I love walking along in the water here, just offshore. Uh, it's about halfway between my knee and waist here. Little plovers, a couple little plovers just flew in front of me here. They go by so quick. If you're not watching, if you blink, you're going to miss them. Some of these birds get pretty close. A little fish darting through. Can you see them darting through every once in a while here? they go. It's easier to see them with the seaweed on the bottom. Yeah, I don't know where they went. They'll be back. There's just millions of them swimming, swimming through here. Millions of them. I'd like to get in a big school of them. I'd like to get in a school where there's some bigger fish. But they don't let that happen. They swim away from you. Beautiful views here this morning, again. Another of my favorite sights, all the little reflections here, the ripples on the sand on the bottom, the little reflections, the sound of the waves. Heard some rumbling. I don't know what it was. I don't know if it was thunder. Or... We're going to get some rain later today. That's for sure. I don't know how much.
Yeah, I am hearing thunder. Definitely hearing thunder rumbling. It's rain down there to the southwest. I think I'm going to make it a house of omelets morning today. I am just craving, craving one of them big, huge, big, huge, big house of omelets. They need to start making glazed donuts over there. I'd be in heaven. I don't think I'd leave that place if they had some fresh glazed donuts. <laughs> Daddy-o up here. In deep thought. In deep thought. Looking up at the blue sky. Make sure he's breathing. Oh, I, I had to make sure you were breathing. Oh, I think I am. Okay. Just enjoying the sounds, the sights and the sounds. Oh, fabulous. Beautiful, isn't it? You been up north yet? Not yet. See old Mike up there. I don't know if he's up there today. Do you think his face is kind of swollen? Could be from what he's going through, yeah. Yeah, it looks all puffed up, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. Yep, could be. Yeah, they Boy, listen to that thunder. Huh? Hear that thunder rolling down there? Can you hear it? The thunder? No, I didn't hear it. Boy, it's rumbling away. It's like a rain this afternoon. Yeah, some rain later. So you okay? I'm wonderful, just wonderful. Really enjoying myself. Have you ever been better? Yeah, no, never better. There you go. The sea and the waves coming in and the sky. Is Amen. Good friends like you lurking by. Skulking about. Skulking, Skulking about. I'm Skulking. Your, your paparazzi. But not ogling. You're not ogling. ogling. I'm not ogling you. <laughs> uh, You're not ogling I'm material. Not over there. <laughs> All right, I'll be back. Maybe. I, I, I have some pretty old girls this morning. You saw some girls worth ogling this morning? Mm -hmm. oh, I bet you did, daddy -o. Well, think of a good thought for the day when I come back, okay? Thought for the day. Yeah, when I come back, we'll have a thought for Other the day. Other than ogling. Other than ogling. Okay, I'll work on it. We don't, we don't want to um, promote ogling. No, 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 we don't want to promote ogling. Just after a minimal. <laughs> a minimal. minimal. There you go. <laughs> oh, Roy and his ogling. He said he saw a pretty girl down at Vanderbilt this morning. And he was ogling. And he got caught. <laughs> oh, Roy. You know, you're never too old. At least in your mind. <laughs> God bless him.
shallow out here right now. Hey, hit that share button. Invite your friends to join us. Invite your friends to the party. Nothing to be scared of here. No one here to intimidate you. Just a wonderful, wonderful beach family. All the little fish popping out of the water out here. If you look really close, really close, you can see them shimmer. You can see the little silver shimmers as they go by here. Always fascinated by the amount of little fish swimming around out here. Oh, school was coming up to me, but the current pulled him out. There was a big school making its way by me. Here comes some more. They're hard to see here. They blend right in with the bottom. Very hard to see. But trust me, there's gazillions of them, not millions or billions. There's gazillions of them out here. There's also one fly. It won't go away. It keeps landing on the gimbal. One hitchhiker fly. Where I am at, the water is plenty deep enough for a dolphin to come up and say good morning. Plenty deep enough. It's waist deep. We've seen dolphins in inches of water.
Boy, that thunder is not letting up. It's pretty far away. Out to the west here, looking out to the west, big thunderstorm all the way down to the south. Almost constant thunder coming out of it right now, just a low rumble. go have a little chat with Roy after I conclude this live feed it's just kind of hard right now so he's having a very difficult time hearing so we'll see how it goes I told him to come up with a thought for the day for us that'll be fun a Royism Those of you that like to send stars, remember you can send a stars, send stars to any of my videos. It doesn't have to be a live feed. So if you're going back and looking at some of our older videos, if you like what you see, send some stars. Happy Sunday, everyone. Happy Sunday. I hope you're having a good one. See all that red drift algae on the beach here. Kind of stinking up the beach. There's a lot of it up just a little further north, a lot. It's not gonna hurt anything, it just doesn't have the best of smells as it's decomposing. I'm going to go up a little further, maybe up to the trees, the dead trees in Area 5, before turning around. I've got to con conserve my battery power here so I can have a little visit with Roy. Look for that video later today.
Got a lot of seaweed up there. I was looking for Fisherman Mike to see if he might be up here today. I know Roy would love to see him. It was a treat to see him the other day out here. A surprise, a big surprise to see Mike out here. Snowy egret. Hey. <laughs> Bob, Bob. <laughs> Good, how are you doing? Never seen so much red. Red here. Yeah, well, yeah, I've, I've, I've seen it way worse than this. I've seen them bad at Fort Myers. Yeah, really they deep. Yeah, they get it bad up there. Fortunately, we're not Fort Myers. No. <laughs> Have a great one. You got that right. So beautiful up here, so beautiful. Beautiful look at Wiggins Pass. Beautiful view of the north end of the park and Wiggins Pass.
Can you see all the little snowy egrets lined up on the shore over there? water is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful here. Well, I'm going to hang a Yui here, start making my way back down the beach. Awesome out here.
you. Good luck. The marine, the marine patrol. I don't know if you see that boat way offshore there. That's the marine patrol. Florida Fish and Wildlife. FWC. Hey, good morning. How are you? I'm good. It's okay. We're always out there swimming, right? My daughter went with him. He wanted to go out. Yeah, as long right. as he's... <laughs> he needed a little help. Somebody. He was asking somebody, and they kind of didn't want to help him. So I sent my kid out with him. All right, yeah. We're out there just hanging out. Okay, thanks. See that algae here out in the water. Stinking up the beach. PU. Oh, the rangers up here telling people to get out of the water. Oh, two fishermen out there telling them to get out. Just right here where this red flag is from here north. You're not supposed to go out into the water. The north end of the park, fishing only, no swimming.
Well, Roy got a plunge in here. Hope he doesn't drown. <laughs> Hope he's behaving himself out here. Well, probably gonna forego Roy's thought for the day since he decided to go out in the water here. I can't hang out here at the beach all morning. Roy thinks everyone in the world's retired. <laughs> but at least he got his plunge in. That's what counts. I'm glad he got to do that. We can get his... Maybe a stop for the day tomorrow. We'll see how the morning goes, what the weather is like. I'm guessing it's probably gonna start deteriorating tomorrow. We'll see. He's in seventh heaven right now. He's got a pretty gal helping him out of the water. He is one happy camper out there, believe me. He is a happy, happy, happy camper right now. Without his noodle. Roy is out there without his noodle.
He's lost his noodle. And here he comes. He's gonna stall here. He's gonna walk extra slow here. Watch. <laughs> Gotta love him. Thank you. Thank you for taking care of Roy. Yeah. You're a lucky guy, Roy. You got a great lifeguard this morning. Thank you so much. Well, you are a lucky guy. You're welcome. You have a good day. Your mom's up there somewhere. Can you believe she's 25 years old? Yep. <laughs> oh, oh Roy. Help me? Yep. Oh, Good old Roy. Yep. Well, time to get shoving off here. Yeah, I'll get my pants on. Okay. Did you see Mike? No, Mike. I didn't see Mike up oh, there. No, nope, I didn't see him. We'll catch him one of these days. He'll be back, I'm sure. What do you think of old Roy boy? You think he was happy this morning? You think he had a good morning? <laughs> oh, Roy. He's going to have to go home and get a snort of oxygen. <laughs> God bless him. God bless him. call it quits here thanks for the stars it's your friendship and financial support that keep Southwest Florida television going without the both of them I wouldn't be out here Those of you that are regular and monthly supporters, thank you so much. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. My regular supporters, those that have made that monthly commitment, thank you. I really want to see that number grow there. It's slowly growing. Slowly on the incline. And of course, those of you that send a little extra a little bonus a little thank you to my paypal account now and then thank you very much i really appreciate that all the many ways you show your appreciation thank you you can always find a link to my paypal account in the description of this post remember whoever sends the most amount of stars in the month of august or is going to win one of those Southwest Florida Television Pirate Lanterns, as well as one of our lucky supporters. One of our lucky supporters. So make sure you sign up to be a supporter in the month of August to be included in that drawing. It's time to truck on out of here. We'll get our thought for the day, maybe later with, or tomorrow with Roy. We'll see what happens. Keep you in suspense. Tuesday might be an interesting weather day out here. Tuesday might be kind of exciting. We'll see what happens as two storms churn their way up the Gulf towards Louisiana. That could be interesting. Uh, 
Well, be sure to spread the word about Southwest Florida Television. Spread the word and share the love. Bringing people together one beach walk at a time. That's what it is all about. We all got drawn together because of our love for the beach. And then we discovered what a wonderful group of people we have here. And it's just gotten bigger and better and still growing. Isn't that amazing? Isn't that amazing? Spread the word, please. Let everyone know what you're doing in the mornings. Hey, tally ho, everyone, tally ho. For Southwest Florida Television, I'm Rob Stan. God bless.